So Richard and Cherry Keaton were born literally half a mile from here in the next village of Thwaite at a time when the lead mines were in decline and there was a lot of poverty. But they had a real rich heritage in terms of the surrounding countryside and um, their grandfather and father taught them a lot about nature and they spent their days on the moors looking at the streams and that this was something that I think created a lifelong interest in the natural world. As part of um, our research we wrote to both uh, Sir David Attenborough and Chris Packham and they both replied and particularly David Attenborough said it was because of particularly Cherry Keaton that he became inspired to go into the field of um, wildlife photography and nature programs um, and to think that you know two boys from a very remote Dales village went on to become pioneers in wildlife photography and sharing their knowledge with the general public is quite astounding really. So the brothers were the first um, to actually photograph birds in situ in their natural environment on the nest. When they first suggested doing this it was met with an outcry of disbelief and they were told it was probably impossible. So they developed some natural hides so that they could sit and wait for the birds to return to the nest to start to capture some of the images. They never ever lost their connection with Swaledale and North Yorkshire. It was something very dear to them. They always talked about it in their public talks. Richard, you know, would come and Cherry would come back for Muka show. They'd come back to visit friends here. And they still kept a very active interest in life in, in the Dales because a lot of their relatives were still here. But I think, you know, anybody who looked at their work can't help but make that connection that they were inspired by their childhood environment and surroundings.